If you own a motorhome and you've ever wondered what the difference is between a sway bar and a track bar, you're going to want to watch this video. Hi, I'm Tommy Henderson and I'm joined by Mike DeMith and uh, we're starting a new series. We haven't quite settled on the title for it yet. We thought about FYI Friday, um, since you asked, something like that, but uh, please let us know what you think it should be called. But point is, uh, we just want to start addressing some common questions that uh, different people may have. And today we're going to start with uh, one that Mike, I think you've heard at some rallies. So yeah, one of the one of the most common questions we get not only at rallies, but also in our seminars is what's the difference between a sway bar and a track bar? Basically, the easiest way to describe that is the sway bar is up it, upper body body sway and the track bar actually helps you with your steering. So when you have this feeling up at the wheel, that's your back end moving. And like this coach, the F53, it's got a, it's got a track bar in the front, but doesn't have one in the back. Well, this one does that. Didn't come with one. It didn't come with one. Right. So your leaf springs do locate the axle. They keep it from moving side to side too much versus if this was an air ride coach, it would have to have a track bar because there's nothing in those airbags that keeps that axle from shifting around. But uh, as Mike mentioned, uh, we do find that they help out leaf spring coaches quite a bit too because there is some play in these bushings. These are springs are pretty long too and relatively thin. There's a little bit of flex there. That little bit of movement side to side in that back axle translates to uh, just a feeling of tail wag, like the back end of the coach, especially these F53 coaches, you got a lot of overhang behind the rear axle, a lot of weight back there. That all wants to make the whole thing steer from the back, basically. So you got to counter that with working at the steering wheel in the front. Uh, so that's where our track bar comes in. Uh, it allows the axle to move up and down, but does not allow it to move side to side. It provides a little more positive location versus just the, uh, the springs and spring bushings. So sway bar, as uh, Mike mentioned. Yeah, and the sway bar is, is, is uh, this one here is a replacement of the original OEM bar. And uh, this one originally was at a one and five eighths inch bar, and we, we upgraded it to a one and three quarter inch bar. And then on the rear, we also put another bar. There's so much sway going on. This is such a high profile in the wind. A lot of owners have a real problem trying to control the vehicle going down the road. And so these sway bars really help. And the bigger you go, the better it gets. So you can control that sway. And that's what we're trying to do here. Yep, so the way a sway bar works is as the coach leans, uh, these end links, one side is gonna get pulled up and the other side is gonna get pushed down. So that puts the bar in a twist and the, the stronger the bar is, so the larger diameter it is, uh, the better it's designed, the more resistance it's gonna have to that twist. So it's gonna fight to keep the coach level rather than allowing it to lean way over going around a corner. Yeah, and, and really like uh, we were saying, both of these in combination are really good. So that's what we're trying to say is if you wanna get rid of some sway and you wanna get rid of some movement in the wheel, these are the items you wanna put on this F53. We hope you found this video informative. Hope it uh, answered some questions for you. Please let us know in the comments what topics you may like us to cover in the future. Uh, we wanna cover the things that you're wondering about. So definitely let us know in the comments. If you enjoyed it, please like and subscribe. Uh, if you subscribe, then you'll get notifications when we come out with future videos. And above all, we, wish, we just wanna wish you a safer and happier driving experience.